Hey guys, aren't you? We are here with my first ever Switch game. That's right. Bayonetta. Bayonetta. Um, so, um, I, of course I picked the one game that's like on every other console, but it's mostly because I've always wanted to play this game with you guys and I never had the opportunity to, uh, because, well, I had the opportunity to, I have it on my Xbox 360, but that's like forever ago. And then I have it on my PS3, but the loading times are so annoying on there. And I, I just got a switch recently and I really want to play the second one. Uh, and so I, um, so I got the switch and here we are with Bayonetta on the switch um i've replayed this game a lot of times um it's pretty fun we're gonna jump straight into it pretty soon here i just kind of wanted to tell you how i'm so excited to play this also i finally hit um 80 subscribers thank you so much for the 80 subscriber thank you so much for joining me hope you like in the channel um if you need anything you know message me do whatever you gotta do i'm here for you and thank you for joining in if you got any recommendations you can do that as well we're gonna go ahead and start the game here pretty soon um the only downside is we don't have trophies so we can kind of just go in and do whatever we want with this game i'm probably just gonna do just a simple playthrough of the story nothing too crazy i just want to play this game so i can get to the second one um and do the a whole full playthrough with the second one more so because that one i haven't played so let's pop on in here guys mm. Oh yeah, we can to normal. So, um, easy is very easy in my opinion. I do recommend putting it on normal, but if you are one of those people that struggle with combat, then you might want to put it on easy. But anyway, let's go on in. We're gonna do the first level or the first section of the game. It's gonna be so weird playing on the Switch because I'm so used to playing this on the Xbox. And I'm still getting used to the Switch. That's actually probably the reason why I haven't really been recording um, on the, with the Switch, mostly because it'll be smart to kind of get to used to the game clouds just clouds with the way it is. But still getting used to the console. For the powers so. of the, the Umbra Witches, dwellers of the darkness, and the Lumen Sages, controllers of the light. The clans paid each other great respect, and their efforts to maintain the balance between them defended the just passage of time. Yet one day, that balance was toppled. harmonious clans fell into disagreement and stoked the flames of hatred against each other, resulting in an era of strife. The conflict between the Umbra I kind of am starting to remember some of the combos that I did, but, you know, with the, with the whole new different system, it's so not casualty. my style. <laughs> it was Bosses true. in this game are so fun, too. Fight the tremendous Sorry, I'm kind of talking in the middle of the storyline, but, you yeah. This part doesn't really make sense until you get it later. Weakened by the assault of the secretive dark witches. Years after the balance was lost, the war had ended in the Umbra witches. Oh man, there's reaction times in this game too, and I totally always forget where all the buttons are in this game. I mean, in the, in the Switch. I keep mixing up the X's and the Y's with the Xbox. <laughs> Were extinguished from the earth. All but 
Sure the next part will teach us how to do which time. So we got some tears. Oh gosh, I love this game. Oh yeah, we can change costumes. So um, something they put in into this to this game is that I think that she has a Link costume. Oh my goodness. Yep, there's the Link costume. And then, oh my gosh, she's got like Samus costume. Is that what? Is that Peach? Yeah. Oh my gosh. That's insane. Oh my gosh. The fact that they have these just kills me. I really want to play with the original, but I really want to play with one. Oh my gosh, there's a little Luigi on there. That's so crazy. Grant the use of the ability to summon a certain spiky spelled king through a wing. Oh, that sounds so cool. Enjoy a new kind of gameplay with included Master Sword and High Wing. Oh my gosh, that is. I'm like literally. Oh my. Uh, to block. Oh wow. Okay, well, yeah, you in the direction of enemy. That's so interesting. Oh wait, I want to look at this one. The suit of the with its beam and firing can. The suit is everything a girl needs to overcome the hospital spider of fire. Oh, you get like an aimed. It's so cool. You can also hold down to lower the suit's price. That's so cool. All right, let's see what this one gives. Oh yes, summon a certain spiky shell. That's so cool. Oh my gosh, I don't know what I want to do. I really want to. I'm gonna. I'm gonna do it. I want to do it. I want to do it. And then here's the difficulty. Alright, let's uh, go back. So let's start. So we're in the prologue here, so let's do the vestibule. We're gonna save. Just because saving is important. I might have a separate file where I'm just playing and trying out all these different um, skins. So let's do this. Oh my gosh, she's gonna have such a ridiculous outfit. I'm so ready. <laughs> uh, one thing that is different from this game to the other ones is that she has these crazy outfits. She definitely does not have these outfits in the PS3 and Xbox version. So, Xbox 360 that is. I can't wait to see this, this outfit. It looks like Humpty Dumpty's taking his last fall. Even old Eggman the Destroyer gets scrambled in the end, right? You know, I still don't get why the hell you drag me out here for these things. I just drop off the merchandise. Hey, bet you can't guess what today is. Reading the good Lord's book ain't gonna do much. People been waiting for this asshole to get whacked for ages. Please. Now, look around. There's no love lost for old Humpty Dumpty. But you gotta keep the outfit happy. 
we don't take care of him, they take care of us. And I prefer my shoes made out of rubber, not concrete. But hey, it's that kind of town. Without good-hearted souls like us to put these bastards six feet under, where'd society be? Of course, the pay's not bad either. <laughs> Jesus, you really get into this shit, don't you? If it were me, I'd be praying he ends up barbecued. Or at least sunny side up. <laughs> <laughs> you can keep praying, but the only way this guy's meeting the Lord is if God's hungry for breakfast. <laughs> Speaking of hungry, we done here. My kids are baking me a birthday cake tonight. Cute little fuckers, I tell you what. Well then, adios. What the fuck? They're here? For this douchebag? Ah! I hate this damn light! I can't see a thing! Oh! But they're there, ain't they? You hearing me? You, you can see them, can't you? I see them. They are instruments of God, descending upon his heavenly rays to Earth. Oh my God! Dear Lord, grant us guidance, and keep safe the souls of our loved ones for all eternity. Oh, we're gonna see the crazy outfit, here it comes. We get to see her royal pinkness, pinkness, inside of the black outfit. Actually, we might see the black outfit. I don't know, I don't know if it lights it to the cinematics or not. There they are, our first fighters. Oh my gosh, there it is. The pink outfit. This is gonna be so ridiculous. Oh 
Oh my gosh. <laughs> Okay. You can use the touch screen? But I'm not wearing I'm not doing my touch screen. Attack. That's what's important, is evading. Which time? Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Okay. Which time is what makes this game completely essential? Like, at least for the, the difficulty we're playing on. Alright, let's go. I like how instead of the usual, instead of halos, it's the...
but to dodge that, way better. I'll be used to the dodging. Take some time, I'll get used to it. Time to shoot some stuff. I just bought the damn thing! Haven't you figured it out yet? There's no quarter for you in this world. <laughs> Over. Flame. Oh, Radon should be paying me for even touching these toys. You have any idea how much this is gonna cost to fix? How the fuck do I always get wrapped up in this shit? Hmm. Engine still purrs nicely. Now, about this little thing you've been looking into for me, Enzo. Let's have a quick chat. See? This is why I told you I was going home. I just got held up in the air by some invisible things, and you want an intelligence briefing? It never stops with you! You keep belly aching like that, and you're liable to wake Eggman from the dead. And I don't think either of you would like that. Ah! 
catch you later, Bayonetta. Something tells me you're gonna need a rush on our special project before this shit hits the fan. Wait, Rodan. What about Eggman? Such a popular chap. I bet they hate him down there as much as you did when he was up here. We just need to make sure he won't come crawling back when they kick him out. Nothing a flower bed can't fix. Fill her up. You heard the man. Finish up in five minutes or you're walking home to your cake and candles. What? Don't you leave me here! So calm. You're still getting screwed in all this too. Of all the low-life scum in too deep in this town, I've never seen one get wrapped up in a fight with God's messengers. Dressed like a nun too. When you end up in the afterlife, that's not going to be pretty. I can't help it if I like the little outfits. The toys are nice. <laughs> hey, hey, 20 years ago, you woke up stuck in a casket at the bottom of a lake. All you can remember is that you're a witch. But now, you're stuck because you gotta sacrifice our halo-wearing friends every day or they'll drag your ass back down to hell. I know, I thought I got screwed, but being forced to slap around the divine for a living? That's really getting screwed. If I needed a biographer, you wouldn't be my first choice. I see to the funeral. You get me the information I asked for. That was our deal. Ha 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 ha! Come on now! Look at my poor car! I'm working for free after this! At least let me get a drink at Rodan's before you start drilling me. The info I got is good. It's gonna get you close to finding the other stone in the pair and figuring out some of that lost past of yours. I swear. <laughs> After jewels instead of cash. Just like a girl. <laughs> Jesus! Can't you take a joke? Enzo. Someone's given you a present. Too bad. I can't stand bugs.
those assholes sure know how to get attention. Even perk the ears of the hotheads down home. You don't say. It's getting harder and harder to tell the worlds apart. Human world. Inferno. Paradiso. Who can tell the difference? Even harder with Purgatorio in the middle. Fight long enough in there and you'll really lose sight. Why the sudden interest in metaphysics? It's a balance, right? Even if some of them like messing around with the humans, we've all got a stake in the status quo. But people keep fucking around like this, the Book of Revelations is gonna look like Mother Goose. Heaven and Hell are gonna go straight for each other's throats. Heaven and hell can tear each other to pieces, for all I care. I've got my own problems to worry about. Something's up. Everything was a bit too bracing. And Enzo's tip makes the timing too perfect. This reeks of a setup. Someone in one of those lost memories calling you out. I got a little present for you. These babies are special. Built from an alloy the devil himself would kill to get his hands on. Don't break these, because they're one of a kind. I don't go in for strange offers. Then again, I'm getting a little tired of these weaklings they keep throwing at me. Maybe I should aim for something a bit more... high class. Pounding them down tonight, baby. Not to butt into your affairs, but I'm pretty sure you got somewhere better to be. The guys you're up against aren't the type to wait for you to finish a round. <laughs> the music went away. Enzo, her drinks are going on your tab, buddy. <sighs> you did beat motherfucker. <laughs> other ones you can get. Ugh, the wood screens are so much better. I love Angel Attack. This fun. Which one do you attack with? get a mega lollipop.
think I'm just gonna get a mega lollipop. Oh, we can get a witch heart. Oh, this one just automatically replenishes it for the whole. Got a mega. You get to play one of those every time you beat a chapter, so it gets pretty nice. Okay, so that's chapter one. We just did the, um, the prologue. I am gonna change my costume back. I like the outfit, but I would I would rather play it more so when um kind of want to play it around more. Just how do I change it back? Restore default. There we go. I'll mess around with it when I when I when I want to. I like our original outfit a little bit more, honestly. I think it's just more for just what I'm comfortable with. So we're gonna save. Overwrite that. There we go. We have seventeen thousand already, that's not bad. Alright guys, so that was the prologue, a little bit provocative, more provocative than usual, mostly because of the outfit that I chose. Um, I mean her other outfit can get provocative too, but at least it's like a full suit so you don't see as much going on as we did with the beach suit. Um, I will eventually want to play and try with the Link outfit. I might do like a chapter with it. I'll pick like, my favorite chapter or something, or maybe you guys can pick a favorite chapter. And I'll play it with the Link outfit and see how different it is. And maybe we'll do one with the Samus as well, just to test out the outfits. But I uh, see from the Peach and the Daisy one that chances are it's just going to... I think when you summon, it'll probably summon something cool. But overall, those outfits kind of stay the same. Anyway, guys, I'll catch you guys in the next video where we will continue onward to chapter one. So I'll catch you guys there. Please subscribe, comment, and make a girl happy. And this was what they guys watching. Peace out.